It's glittering in Vanilla Dome! I don't know why the level balls are so big here. I don't know why. Perhaps it was a design choice they thought was fun. It does fit. I'll give you that. They do what they were doing. I do not want that. You don't. You pretty much never really need the red, the the mush, the fire flower thingamajig. You pretty much, you pretty much always in the clear with just a feather. Oh yeah, I remember this one. Now you can try to jump that, but I won't. I'll instead wait until I get that switch. And I know exactly where that switch is, so don't worry about that. This is a very fun part, I have to say. Get a star, start running. Well, it'll stop running if you're carrying a feather, or you'll start flying. Then you'll miss your golden opportunity. <laughs> he like lands on his chest and half on his chin. Come on, Mario, you gotta take it to the limit. Yeah, you gotta give it all your best, they say. You gotta give it your very best, you gotta take it to the limit. Look, he's walking diagonally. 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 Lots of secret levels all of a sudden! This one too possesses a secret level. It starts off with you falling. Super Mario Bros. 2, anyone? This is a one of those flipper things out of the water. Just kick him and he's dead. He's not even a threat. Now if you brought a Yoshi, you have to ditch him here, I'm afraid. You see, this is a vine block that you just can't get around. And Yoshi cannot climb vines, so you're pretty much forced to give him away. To charity, no less. Nobody likes charity. Out of those smug sons of bitches and their money, spending it on people who don't even want it. I don't see poor African people coming to my front door and asking for money, so how do you know they want it? Charity! That is, by the way, the most awful thing you could say with the most awful argument for it. I forgot, that was the block I didn't want to hit. One thing I dislike is how the HUD is so unnoticeable, and this is, by the way, how you get the secret. The HUD doesn't... it doesn't splash at me. It doesn't come to my face. I could insert another sexual innuendo, but I do not feel like it. You swim a lot faster with the key, so I like carrying objects with me underwater. They also make you float. So here's the pink switch, so we can get the Vanilla Dome secret. So, um, I want to say that they say shortly here there are two ways you could actually do the following area, and I do not like to do both of them. MLG legit! I don't know why it's supposed to be legit too, but who gives a fuck? Mario got the Red Switch Palace. Wait, it actually looked like pink. PINK! I don't know, this looks dark red. Let me make it a bit of an arbor brown. And this looks pink as fuck, man, that switch. And now it's red. Whoever made this did not discuss with the art department what it was actually supposed to be. But let's get the secret. So, a few things up and running. If you get the secret, you unlock an entirely different path. Now, if you thought Donut Plane's pattern of going first to the water level, then going all the way... Uh through a ghost house and then an underground level thought that was an obscure secret this one is so off the track record it's impossible to fully understand insert key to begin secret oh god so many secrets to do it's getting annoying 
Oh, I'm getting really tired actually. I don't know why. It's it's not that late. It's 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 fucking Where does the clock go? There was a clock in the bottom right. Well, I guess you do want to show up. Um it's now uh five past half past. What? Um five ten it's it's twelve forty. Let's just keep it to that. It's twelve forty. You do not need any of this bullshit. You can get this even without the springboard, I think, but taking a running start here. Secret to Star Road, which unlocks my most favorite Star Road. So this Star Road unlocks... I think this is the one I love. The one that gives you the blue Yoshi. Yes, this is the blue Yoshi one. You have two options here. You can take the star for yourself, or you can feed it to the Yoshi. I guess I'm taking it for myself this time. Now don't worry about Yoshi's feeding speed. Just stuff her up. This is the blue Yoshi! The most fantastic Yoshi of all! Any shell she eats, or he eats, or whatever the fuck he is... ...will give him wings. Go away, Baron Van Vish. Fuck you, then. They go to sleep after a bit, so don't worry too much about them. So, you can't go into that pipe, but I never, I don't even remember what the fuck that exit looks like. I always went down here to get the secret, the one that unlocks the next star road. So you need to stand here and lick it. You gotta lick it good. Oh yeah, oh you like that bitch, don't ya? And that's a lick lick. Oh shit, that's way too perverted. So this star road goes absolutely fucking lootly nowhere! For now. It actually does go somewhere, and there is a legitimate way to get it, but I will not be getting that now. Instead, I will be completing this one. They can make this with a good running start. No, I can't. I don't care. Wait a minute, I forgot. Look at stupid old me, forgetting that this Yoshi can fly. <laughs> you are an idiot. Ha 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 ha. Fly like an eagle. His name is Fly. Over the sea. And no, you can still not get past Vanilla Dome because there are no Koopa shells before that point. the wrong one, I should be pressing the right one. Well, I, I got one consistently, so that's one thing. Twix! While sitting on a Yoshi. Also known as Yoshi Twix. Or Pixie Twix. So, this is how you can go. You can either go with the bridge down there, which also has a secret path that leads to the star, which I didn't know for the life of me existed for the longest time. Or you can take this upper path that appears to be taking a sky road or something. So let's go to Vanilla Secret 2. I'll probably be playing up to the fortress. Oh. 
No, Yoshi. Yeah, with a good bounce, you can get right back in the saddle. Oh, I guess I'll have to make a sacrifice. We all have to make sacrifice from time to time, right? Oh, lucky two. Or a lock two. Whatever the hell floats you your boat. Oh, this is pretty fun. This is what's known as a gray pea switch. It turns enemies and uh, those chompy plants into coins. Collect enough of these coins to get a one up and a two up. That's. I didn't know you could get two ups. Doesn't matter, Yoshi. Ooh, this water level, we're gonna meet some very fun creatures here. I think I'm gonna end this video on the Resnor Castle. So these are dolphins. Not the ones from Al Delfino, I can assure you that much. Let's actually load this. Select. So these are your uh, dolphins. Their main purpose is to protect you, but from what, you may ask? From the most fiendish creature of them all. Stingy Van Sting! The vilest German f Well, actually, the vilest and most German fish ever to have walked the face of the world. Of Mario World, at least. He is so German that his haircut invented punk. Although I do not know how that should relate. Arrows! No, I thought I was supposed to go left because this is a platformer made in two dimensions. Fuck you. Oh no. These dolphins? They are not fuck you. These are I love you dolphins. I love you. I, lo I love you as much as Mr. Bubbly Bubbly Man. I wish they had plushies of him. I would buy all of them. Because I like Mr. Bubbly Bubbly Man. Oh, fuck you, man. I'm not going without my 50. I don't want the bonus game, but I do like the three free one-ups. Spastic Yoshi. Comes to save the day! This is a fortress. It's essentially a castle-like... Oh fuck, I hate this one. It's essentially a castle-like environment. Yoshi cannot come with you. There is a boss at the end. And it is pretty tough to get through. You need Mini Mario in order to get through it, but it simply skips most of the level to go down there. I do not consider it worth the sacrifice because I will also lose the item in my inventory. Which is not a risk I'm willing to take. Oh, you can also press down while swimming to make tiniest swims. Really good if you want to do some platform grade swimming. Should not press the control stick. Only these falling thorns are pretty much a pain in the butt. So I go to recover it, and then I go to do nothing with it. Action hero! I hate swimming. It's not good platforming. It's it's really random. Come on, Mr. Twompy Twomp. At least there's no secret exit. They never do secret exits in places like this, so don't even worry about it, man. You see, man, it's all the stiffs. Sacrifices have been made. Honor lost. But a mushroom. This is Resnor. Hi, Resnor! We love you! The toughest boss of them all, you cannot defeat him! Well, actually, you can. Hit two and the platform start vanishing.
<sighs> Excuse me about that. I'll probably have to cut some things out there. So yeah, the feet in the fortress unlocked a magical bridge. Next time we'll be exploring Butter Bridge One. See you guys next time.